don't know what I want to wear. La 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 la. So, this is the struggle I have every morning. Usually, I like to do my clothes the night before. I like to set up what I want to wear. But lately, I haven't been doing it. So, now in the mornings, I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. Like, I don't know what I want to wear. So, I just have on these and this top. I'm going to put a cardigan over it. But I picked up some socks at Dollar Tree. They're like um, inside socks. But they feel like they have a little bit thickerness than the regulars. So I might put one of these on because I am going to wear some flats. Um, I'll put you right here for now. This is the stuff that came in yesterday. I was showing you guys. Did I show you guys? So this is one item from Shein. And I still got the box there that I have to do, but let's see what this is. Ooh, this is nice. So I picked up kind of like a sheer top, right? You got a hanger on you. It looks like this so again it has that balloon sleeve but as you can see it is sheer here it's not sheer here but it is here in the center and then i love that it has these black pearl kind of buttons and then the back is like sheer sheer but i thought this was beautiful because i feel like this under a blazer or an overcoat with some you know liquid leather jeans or a skirt or ripped up jeans will be so nice so yeah i don't know why this one came by itself but and then i like the detail on the cuff that's nice that's nice so this is the team stuff that i've been waiting for which is the liner because yeah so this is the liner this feels kind of thin but i guess the point is that the heels don't go through the bars you know through these like bars so i'm gonna do that when i get home from work because i'm actually heading to work now and then hopefully i can put that away and then it'll look a lot more like the vision will come will actually come through then i picked up some boots and i've been looking at these for a while i know these sock boots were in for a while and probably not anymore but so this is like a sock material really nice and it looks like that i got it in a 43 it said 43 was a 10 which 43 i think is usually like an 11 but i like it i like it look at that color so yes this will be nice um usually i have an issue with this part here if you don't have a zipper but it's stretchy so i'm pretty sure i could just you know so that's how it looks so pretty 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 i like it so i'm um, thinking that when i'm wearing like now in the winter like my joggers or if i'm wearing like you know i got a couple of pants that you can cinch the bottom and put this on and i think last year or the year before i picked up a um like a moto jacket from rainbows that was this color it was a little tight I don't know if I kept it or got rid of it, but I'm going to go through my coats to see because I think that would be a look. Ain't that pretty? So I was a little scared to order this because, you know, sometimes you order shoes and 
the sizing is way off but this looks like it's gonna be pretty good only thing is that I don't know if you can see inside it doesn't look like it has like the cushion liner you know so I don't know but I like the traction I like all of it so yeah yes. that's nice that's nice um, so I gotta figure out what I'm going to wear and then I made this little moño thing let me see let me see let me see to try to give my hair like some kind of curl or like some kind of wave and I saw something like that on TikTok where they just made a bun and then wrapped it with this this is that stuff that you put on your wrist when you're washing your face so I haven't reached for this for that, but making a bun and trying to get like some waves, it works sometimes. So yeah, I did that last night, but I think I'm going to make a moño because I don't feel like it looks like the way I wanted it to. Like it looks, I don't know. We'll see. Um, Yeah. And it's about time that I wash it, but... Saturday when I go into the city, my sister's going to dye my hair. She bought some shampoo thing that dyes your hair while you wash it. And I don't want to bring it here and mess up my tub. So, yeah, it is. Um, yeah, so, I don't know. I don't know what I want to wear. And the thing is that at work... It'd be hot, then it'd be cold. Like now I'm having a hot coffee. I feel like I'll get to the job and be like, oh. And then if I have an iced coffee, then I get to the job and I'm like, oof. Like the temperature's just, I don't know. <clears throat> so yesterday I showed you guys this top, which don't match. But this one. Yeah, yes. I think this is what I'm going to do. It's kind of comfy, chunky, which is what I'm looking for. And um, I think I'm going to make a moño. I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to take this sweater, but let's go to the bathroom so I can pick up my hair and do a moño. I did this look, so I already knew I wanted to wear something yellow today. So yes. Um... Let me put this on because my feet is getting cold. All right, <clears throat> so I got a few minutes and I'm just having a piece of the paneton with some butter, the rest of my coffee. And I'm watching the video that went up two days ago, the Sheehan haul. I don't know if I like the background. I don't know if I like how it looks. Um, when I'm in there, I like it. When I watch it back, I'm kind of like, mm. um, I don't know what it is.
I can't get a rolling rack and then put it on the rolling rack and show you. For sure, that's not gonna fit. I also feel like I'm in a funk because I was excited for Vlogmas. I was excited for like the holidays and all that, but I still got Thanksgiving stuff up. So I got the red chair covers because you know, I had put the yellow for Thanksgiving, but I think because I'm bummed that the stuff for the tree hasn't come in, like the bows and the flowers. And right now the only thing there is what the tree is over here, but it just hasn't gotten me in the mood. Mm. So, and I was saying that Once I go to start taking this stuff down, I was gonna take a lot of it to Goodwill because the vase, the vase and like these candle holders, I don't think I want them again because it looks very nice, but it looks very dark. So I was like, and I said I wanted to do traditional colors and all that, which was fine, but I didn't like it. So I got the blue on the sofa. Meanwhile, I still got Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving. The tree, still missing the florals, still missing some bigger bowls. I'm waiting for some that are supposed to be like, um, like these big to put in between. I'm still waiting on some white ones like that. So this is just, all right. So I'm heading to work again, no coat. I do have this jacket that's in the car, but that's like a spring jacket. Um, <coughs> I just, need the car to warm up just a minute a little bit i refilled my prescription and they said tomorrow usually they're like you know whatever time you want but i guess they must be short staffed the panetone was good but i don't really feel like that fills me up like for breakfast you know and then that coffee i don't know if you guys have tried that mushroom coffee that's all over instagram and tiktok I like it I like it but like I was saying there is like some kind of aftertaste so if you drink it hot it's fine it's really good it tastes like that international you know coffee that comes in that little tin but once it starts to warm get like warm like once it cools down a little bit and not like cool down like like a lot it's just like the minute you taste it it's great after like i would say a minute or two you can kind of have like an aftertaste so what i've been doing is i've been having it and putting in also some of my coffee just to like disguise the taste and it's been really good and then i zip 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 foam it up and it's been good I just don't see myself buying that. Like my sister bought it and she's always like, you gotta try this, you gotta try this. So I'm always like, okay, okay. So she bought it and she bought it like on a buy one, get one half off sale. So she gave me the matcha and that one. And it, I've been enjoying the matcha a lot. That one, I don't feel like it has an aftertaste, but I really prefer to have coffee in the morning. Like my first drink to be coffee because mentally I feel like I need the caffeine you know but i don't know so let's go con dios y la virgen today is garbage day i hope my son remembers to put those garbage cans out he went into the bathroom when i was leaving but um yeah so to 
today is the first day of vlogmas i started off doing breakfast and then i kept going and i didn't even say to y'all happy vlogmas day one so i'm excited um and like i said this ain't gonna be where every day is something exciting but i want to try to you know vlog every day so i did this like smoky kind of warm look to go with my outfit and yeah you know i got my stuff set up in the middle like in the little island that i like to call it and i wanted to do like perfumes and stuff there not really like my makeup and get ready but I was kind of telling my husband, you know, I was thinking of moving my makeup into the master. But again, I get up sometimes way before him. And I don't want to be turning those lights on. So, you know, I had done it where I can go around. Like now that the liners came in, I can put the shoes away. I can put a couple of things where they go. And then I'll be able to walk around. So... I'm going to have to be realistic and just, you know, be honest and be like, I get vulnerable. Um, my room ain't the biggest room in the house, you know, by far. But I like that it feels very cozy to me. I like the fact that I know where my stuff is. Um, you know, I don't have like everything displayed. Like when I had the cubes in the against the wall you could see all the sweaters yeah i can see it and it's all there for me but sometimes i just found it to look a little messy even though they're nicely folded because of the chunkiness some of them are fatter some of them are skinny it just look i don't know so i like it i just feel like now when i um uh, film i gotta like back it up like zoom out and then it just looks like you're like, I don't know. I was looking at my video that I did for Shein, not for Shein, my Shein haul. And I like it, but I don't think I love it. Like, I don't know. And I remember when I first started out in that room that I only had a couple of little things I had so much space to like back up, stand up, show you. Blah, blah. And I'm like, my room looked huge to me. Now it's like, girl, what you thinking? But again, that was more of a makeup kind of thing. And all I needed was my makeup desk and my drawers. So, but I'm I'm getting used to it. I'm getting used to it. I I keep watching um like hauls and a lot of the girls that I've been watching like their beauty room is like huge so I feel like that gets me and that's why I say that social media can really mess you up you know as an adult I'm like I I want that but you know you, get, you do what you want like you know you do you do the best with what you got but as a kid I would have been like oh my god we don't got nothing this little house you know so the teens that are watching a lot of the um youtubers and they're like oh my god look at that look they're going here look that's not realistic you don't go every single day to starbucks you don't go every single day to ulta to support you don't do that like that is not reality you know what i'm saying so jack bring it down 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 so you got to be happy with what you got. Be thankful for everything you got and everything you don't. Because you know what they say. More money, more problems. So those bigger YouTubes, I'm sure they've got a bunch of problems that they just don't say. You know what I mean? So be thankful for what you got. So yeah, so and then I haven't, I don't know. I don't feel motivated to like do my Christmas stuff like you know we have vlogmas I should be having my coffee and having my little Santa Clauses and stuff at my coffee station not you know my Thanksgiving stuff like girl 
Pero, that's the reality. Because I wasn't going to change things. I didn't have time to change things. I, you know, I was rushing around doing all this other stuff. And I, the time that I did have, I wanted to at least enjoy a little bit of it. Like when I took the day and I went to the mall, went to Primark, went to all these different places. You know, you want to try to enjoy that a little bit of it. And then I had went to Burlington with my husband and I was so bummed because I didn't find nothing. Oh no, I think I found something. What did I find? A top, like an undershirt kind of top. And um, I think that's it. Oh, and I bought two bras and then the bras. I feel like I have to throw all my bras out and start from scratch because some of them, the cup is perfect. The width of it is a little loose and we've already reached that last hook. So it's not like I can add an extender to it because I'm trying to make you smaller, not bigger. Then the ones that are perfect on the back, the cups feel small and I'm like, oh, you know, and they're brand new. So I'm like, what the hell? But yeah, I'm gonna have to clear a lot of that stuff out because it's a mess, it's a mess. And that's what happens when you go up and down in weight. You know, usually like my back will get bigger and then it'll get smaller. Your cup really doesn't change, I don't think. Like I've been a D to D for the longest. And it used to be like 36C, 38D, 38D, 40D, 42D, 40, you know, like, but I don't know. And that bra that was on Instagram and TikTok and all that with the, look at that, it got all that, that shit is garbage, garbage, garbage. I don't even know why I wasted my money on that shit. I took it to Goodwill the other day. Somebody would be like, this is that stuff on the TV. That shit don't work. So yeah, it is. I'm already at work. So I got to Walmart, Walgreens. I thought I was in at eight. I'm in at eight, at nine. So I came to get my prescription. It's not ready. I want this little cute little bag. Those I think I'm gonna get this white chocolate. I wish they had the skinny syrup, but they don't have skinny. They got like these, what's that? Mexican wedding cake. So I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take the white chocolate and then these little cups. Because this place is packed, packed, packed. Well, I didn't really see anything 
in TJ Maxx. I wanted to get my husband like one of those sweaters that you put over your dress shirt, kind of like a V or like just something with a zipper that he could put over it, you know, because he's always saying how it's cold at his job. Like he's, some days he'll be like, I have my coat on all day. I have my coat on all day. It was so cold. Look, look. So I was looking for something like that, but I didn't want it to be like super thick, just something he could put over the dress shirts. But, you know, that's always a hit or miss in TJ Maxx. And the XL that I was looking at and the double X that I was looking at, they look long, but like narrow. And I feel like that's something that every time I'm looking for something in a sweater for him, in TJ Maxx or Marshalls or something like that, the XL, the double X, they're long but they're not like wide and I don't need it to be long. I need it to be wide. So maybe I'll check like, you know, Burlington or like JC Penney's, someplace like that. Burlington, I don't know. I feel like the last couple of times I've gone to Burlington, it has been a bust. So maybe I'm gonna have to do like Macy's or JC Penney's um yeah i think that's what i'm gonna have to do so i'm already home i ended up ordering pizza that should be here any minute now and i think that's how we're ending vlogmas day one